Democratic gubernatorial candidate Malin Mitchell wants you to join a fight. Because we're in a fight for our future, folks. We're in a fight for better health care. We're in a fight for our families. We're in a fight for our children. We're in a fight for better wages, better jobs, education, a better day in Wisconsin so that all will be able to benefit, not just a select few. Mitchell announced his candidacy Monday on a platform of improving the quality of life for working class citizens. Together we can win this fight. Together we can bring real lasting change. That's what we can do for this great state with all hands working. Mitchell's background as a firefighter union representative led him to a failed run for lieutenant governor in the 2011 recall elections, but his strong stance against Governor Walker's policy has already attracted supporters. Citizens are struggling, and I think he can make the right choices to get our state back uh, in the right direction. Mitchell's campaign hopes that his background in union leadership will help attract working class voters. But he's joining a crowded ring of Democratic candidates all vying for the governor's office. Mitchell joined seven other contenders in the race. Activist Mike McCabe, former party chairman Matt Flynn, notable businessman Annie Gronick, State Senator Kathleen Weinhout, School Superintendent Tony Evers, and Representative Dana Walks have all announced their candidacies, and at least two more, including Madison Mayor Paul Sogman, are also expected to run. With stiff competition, Mitchell will need to stand out of the crowd. He as a union leader has advocated on behalf of those working families, uh, decisions that he makes uh, people live and die by, so that's really what sets him apart. The Democratic candidate will be selected during the primary on August 14th, but in the meantime, Malin Mitchell's campaign is getting crowds fired up. Are you ready? Yeah! I can't hear you. Are you ready? Yeah! I can't hear you. Are you ready to do it? The Badger Report. I'm Chris Lewinberg.